hey guys welcome back to a new vlog i just realized i haven't started this vlog so today is monday my leave actually starts today so um i actually don't have any luggage guys because from all the travels actually most of my luggage has broken it's either it's got like a missing um wheel or it just broke if you travel quite a bit you'll know that they break luggage quite a bit so um i'm currently at macro i just came to buy new luggage and i actually didn't realize so sorry if you're new welcome my name is christine and if you're returning thank you so much for coming back i actually didn't realize so tandy and i didn't realize that our flight was actually at two like five minutes to two in the afternoon so we just want to be there on time so that we don't stress and i had booked my relaxer touch up for tomorrow at nine which means i basically cannot make it for that time so um i need to try get my hair done today which is what i'm gonna try do um now i'm heading to santa and i found a salon well my sister helped me find a salon there hopefully they take walk-ins and i'm able to do my hair otherwise i'm basically screwed because i've got so much growth um and i just don't think it's gonna look cute when we travel but yeah um i'm gonna do that but i just thought i'd come on here and start the vlog and just let you guys know what we're doing for today um but at least i got you on time it's currently quarter past they open at nine i've gotten my luggage so i'm now heading to the salon and then i just need to buy a pair of sandals and then we're gonna get our nails done when we get home so yeah there's like a lot that i still need to do today so basically not going to be sleeping much so yeah let us go so that we arrive there early enough for them to fit us in you know for them to fit us in so yeah i guess you guys will spend the day with me this will be like a travel prep before we actually travel because we leave tomorrow and i'm super super excited so yeah the other stressful thing is that i have to pack for two trips but i'll let you guys know on that a little later so yeah let us get going so I made it to the salon and they're able to help me, thank God, because I was going to die. So this is what my hair currently looks like. Just text, I know it's a toss oh, but I hate the fact that we lost such a the Uber pulling up on call. Tell me as you trying to fall through. I'ma leave it up to you. What you wanna do? Look, I'm trying to spend this time with you. No, we overdo what you're doing right now. Right now. Baby, won't you swing my way? It's been a day and I've been thinking all oh, loud. I know I want you. Long time since the last time. Got a tab, we could run up. Do you hey guys, so it's been a long day and I basically trying to fix the lighting. Struggled to vlog. Well, I didn't vlog because. There was just too much going on but this is my hair i really like what it looks like um so i went to le lux and it's in santon i will try put their um instagram in the description box for you guys so yeah i got just a relaxer touch up as you guys saw so they just relaxed like the roots and then she just blow dried my hair and also straightened it so yeah I'm super happy that I actually go with like relaxed hair because I did not think I was going to manage with um, my script pot that was going on. So yeah, I also just purchased a few products from them. I've been looking for the Mizani Miracle Length um, Hairline and Root Stimulator. So these come in like a dropper and you can just apply them on like your hairline and then your... Mm, yeah that's what the hairline basically looks like and on your entire scalp and it helps your hair like grow so i also just purchased don't mind that that's my sister she's trying on clothes i actually should be packing as well and then i also purchased the, the scalp um so 
this is what it looks like the scalp care it's for dry scalp and then if you've also got braids and extensions and it's also from Mizani so I purchased these products from them this one was 220 and this one was 680 I know this one is generally a bit pricey so yeah and then another thing just to update you guys I did my nails so my nails are a little bit dry right now and it's like cold I just went for like an almond shape and then I did like a white French um, and then yeah I just wanted to show you guys because I am going to be away from tomorrow is the 12th and I only return on the 30th I am going to unfortunately have to pack stuff to like wash my hair and treat it because 15 whole days well how many days is that 17 is that 17 18 days or however many days it is I think it's like 18 days I don't know actually I don't know whatever number of days that is is too long to not wash my hair so I have this here I think I mentioned it in one of my previous vlogs it's a Mayel um, hydrating conditioner I'm obviously gonna try get my hair to like last me longer than a week before I wash it but yeah I'm just gonna carry like my shampoo and conditioner just to make sure that I'm able to wash when I am away and then I went into Edgar's because I wanted to purchase some sandals and I bumped in this, into this cute little bag as I was about to leave. So it's like super cute and I thought this was like the perfect bag for my holiday and I feel like it will match the majority of my outfits. And the one thing I liked about it as well is that it's got this cover at the top so I can easily just tie this, you know, and just make sure that everything of mine is secure because guys, in Europe, they pickpocket if you didn't know. So yeah that is super cute and i got it on special so it was 150 so the original price was 290 uh 299.95 which is 300 rand but i got it for 150 so if you're interested i will try obviously upload this vlog on time so if you're interested you can go check out edgar's they were having like quite a few specials let me just quickly show you guys the sandals that i got so i've got like three pairs because i know a lot of people that are generally going to europe are like pairing up all their outfits with sandals so you just need to have like majority comfortable sandals so i got these from kelso and like the one thing i liked is the fact that the sole feels very soft so i could already tell that i can last in these like all day so i got these with like this jelly thing here and then i got another pair which looks like this so it's just like a nudie pair so it's like material here and then it's sort of like a pleather thing here which is comfortable and then the last pair that i got was these ones over here so yeah i got these and then yeah i got my luggage in the morning which i need to start packing in so yeah majority of my clothes are from sheen i'm gonna have to pack like a couple of things like for other days so i think i'm gonna start doing that because there's one batch of clothing that i actually didn't try on and Right now, I just feel like I'm just going to pack, and if it doesn't fit, it doesn't fit. We'll see when we get there, which is what my sister is doing right now. She's trying on her clothes. So I should most probably do that, and then I'll show you guys when I pack. But we also have load shedding in a bit, so I'm worried about that. So, yeah. Let us get packing, and yeah, hopefully we finish. And then tomorrow, we just going to have to wake up and head to the airport in the morning. So, yeah, I will check you guys just now morning guys so this vlogging and this vlog i don't really know how long it's gonna be but yeah um it's currently 4 a.m this is travel day so obviously we were hit by load shedding last night so i couldn't finish packing so i decided to go to sleep which i struggled because i was super stressed i was just like what if i can't find outfits on time and yeah it's just too stressed so i've managed to create like two outfits almost per day oopsie almost two outfits per day so i have like day and night outfits for my nine nights which is 10 days and it 10 days <laughs> now you guys would have guessed where we're going but obviously for those of you that follow me on instagram would have seen by the time this vlog goes up so yeah um i've come up with my outfits now i need to pack my few work outfits which i'm gonna do now as soon as i put all of these in the suitcase but i just wanted to show you guys how i planned out my outfits so that you guys can see how it's so much easier to lay out your outfits and then pack them into your suitcase as soon as you've like counted them and you know what's going on and what's where so let me show you guys 
so don't mind the mess but most of my outfits guys are actually from sheen i think this whole row here is from sheen and then these are like things i had so i have like all of these and tandy and tandy suggested that i go for color this time and i'm super happy because these look super good um you guys know i love my black and white but i definitely did purchase some color this time so yeah and then my mom was kind enough to drop off these two dresses yesterday they are super beautiful can't wait to wear them so she dropped those off yesterday and those are some of my options to wear and then i have like some pretty closet dresses i think these i'll wear like for dinners this as well i've never worn i got this from h&m it was like on special and then this is like a dream apparel outfit which i'm most probably also going to wear for like a dinner so i sort of know the type of colors i want to wear where so yeah that doesn't really matter how i pack and then these are sort of like extras for like dinner or if i decide i don't know if i need a change this is for one of the days i think we might go to the lake so i've taken this i'm most probably gonna wait with like a shirt and maybe like a bralette inside and Tandy was kind enough to give me this dress of hers, which is super beautiful. Can't wait to try it out and see what it looks like on me. So yeah, I'm just going to quickly pack these into my luggage and then pack my um, makeup and my skincare. As soon as that's done, then I can pack my work clothing, which I'll show you guys as well. guys welcome back so um i'm done packing now just waiting for my sister to come back i'm a little worried that my luggage might be a little too heavy because i did say i am packing for two trips but there's nothing much i can do now i just have to wait till it's like weighed properly i did use a scale but it keeps changing between 21 and 24 so i'm not too sure because i think our baggage allowance is like two times 23 and i have two of them one is 19 and one is possibly 24 or the other one is more than 19 i don't know but this house is a mess but yeah i'm not really too sure how much content i have on here and i'm not too sure whether i want to end it now or whether i want to continue until i get to the airport just to get that out of the way or whether i want to include that in the upcoming vlog um, to like start the travel vlog the house is a little bit of a mess but there isn't much we can do right now so yeah um, i'm just waiting for my sister to get up and then i'm gonna call the uber and then we are going to leave i'm super super excited just praying that obviously i pray that the lord keeps us safe throughout our entire journey so yeah waiting for this girl to come back i'm really worried about our suitcases to be honest but we'll see when we get there i guess um so yeah basically packed everything if i've forgotten something i've forgotten it there's nothing much i can do right now so yeah that's basically the type of that's the mentality i have right now um so yeah i am i was gonna show you guys what i'm wearing i'll show you guys when we get outside because the house is a mess right now and i don't want you guys seeing it in this state so i'll show you guys when we get downstairs and then yeah i'll vlog quite a little bit and then i'll start off the new vlog at the airport super excited
Hey. Hey. How are you doing? Good. It's rolling. So this is like the travel prep vlog. I haven't ended it yet. Yeah, we're just so we are at duty free because we're trying to get some our keys because iro <laughs> iabiza. So we're basically trying to figure out what we want, and then yeah. Hey guys, not us buying our alcohol and <laughs> looking for a flask. <laughs> no, those Please flasks. tell them how dodgy I was. She's like, sorry, I'm looking for a flask. <laughs> they look for a flask. She's like, that one where you <laughs> That's what and I the basically guy is asked. Looking for. At her like, Aren't you supposed to be a lady? Whispering? Yeah. She's like, don't speak too I'm loud. Like, don't scream. Just because the other one is like, let's go ask. But I'm like, don't scream. And then Kevin has it. They might have it. They might not because I don't think they promote drinking. Do you think I still need to buy a bottle? We can just use one. No, just use one, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we took a bottle with us because water can be very pricey. And the nice thing when you're in Europe is that you can drink like the water from the fountains, which is what we're gonna do because it's like very clean. So, yeah, nice, At least... oh, yes, yeah. that's yours, is it? Yes, that's mm -hmm. yours. So, we're going to the lounge now, and I'm gonna end the vlog here mm -hmm. and then. Officially gonna start the travel vlog for you guys. So I'm super excited. How do you feel? This is like our so first excited. trip together. Yeah, our she first always drops me off here. It feels so weird being with her at Terminal A, guys. <laughs> <laughs> minutes. Jimmy, you can eat something. Because if you forget that, what if the food is not good?